<laughs> there goes Lofty. I'm going to have some fun. <laughs> Great! We saved the logs for you. Can you stack them at the side of the road, please? Oh, uh, I think so, yeah. <laughs> Let the fun begin! Watch out, Lofty! There's a mouse! A mouse! A mouse! <laughs> <laughs> oh, if my van isn't fixed by tomorrow, I don't know how I'm going to deliver all of these. Oh, I bet that's someone else wanting to know where their parcel is. <laughs> Some parcels need delivering, eh? I can help with that. <laughs> Special delivery spuds on the job! sacks there when I went inside. <gasps> this sack's really heavy. No wonder Mr. Dixon uses a van. Hello, Spud. Travis, what are you doing here? I've just delivered some cabbages to the market. What are you doing? I'm delivering these parcels for Mr. Dixon, and you can help me. Uh -huh. Spud, are you sure this is a good idea? Of course it is. I told you, I'm helping Mr. Dixon deliver these parcels. And what's Mr. Dixon got to say about that? He won't mind. But how will you know who they belong to? You can't read. So, all Mr. Dixon does is drive about giving parcels to people. I can do that. <laughs> Come on, Travis. Oh. Uh. Special delivery! Oh, there's a lot of care going into that rapid. Parcel for Wendy! Parcel for Bob! <coughs> See? It's easy. <laughs> there we are. Finished. Now, let's see about that parcel. Hello, Mr Dixon. Bob here. I thought I'd pop by and pick up my parcel. What? Disappeared? OK, I'll call you if I find it. Bye. Listen, team, Mr Dixon has lost one of his sacks, the one with my parcel in it. Scoop, come with me and we'll see if we can find it. Let's go. Oh, there you are, Mrs Potts. Finished at last. Oh, and it looks lovely, Wendy. Special delivery! Oh, but, but uh, I... No need to thank me. Special delivery spud, that's me. <laughs> but I ordered a new hat. Here he comes. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, better than I could have hoped for. <laughs> That's a good one, Lofty. Come on, you can get up again now. No, uh, I can't. What do you mean you can't? Oh, oh, I can't. Oh. oh, no. Hang on. I'll go and get help. Scoop! 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 What is it now, Spud? I'm busy. It's Lofty. He's stuck on his side and he can't get up. You've got to come and help him. Stop messing about, Spud. I've got work to do. But, Scoop, Lofty really is in trouble. What's all this about Lofty being in trouble? Lofty's stuck. Honest, Bob. Well, he should have been here by now. Better safe than sorry. Come on, let's go. Oh! 
Softy! Don't worry, we'll soon have you right side up. Oh, I hope so. Right then, all together now. There, Lofty. Are you all right? Oh, I think so, yeah. Thanks, Bob. Oh, thanks, Scoop. Better thanks Spud. He was the one who came for help. Um, well, um, it was my fault, really, Bob. I, I gave Lofty a fright and that's why he got stuck. Oh, I see. Well, what do you say then, Spud? Sorry, Lofty. Oh, that's OK, Spud. I'm making a little present for Scoop and Muck. <laughs> One, two, three, mud pies away! Hey, what's going on? Oh, oh no! It's Spud! <laughs> Come back! Can't catch me! Can't catch me! <laughs> na, 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 na. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Help! Help! Uh, uh. Travis, Farmer Pickles is gone. Oh, this is fun. Yeah, it's really exciting. <laughs> I've never slept in the country before. Oh, is it different sleeping in town then? Yeah, in town there's always cars and things going past and the street lights are on all night. I suppose you think it's very dark out here then? Uh, uh, oh, y yes. Yeah, it, it, it is dark, isn't it? Oh, oh yes. And, and quiet. Yes, and, and, and quiet. Oh, dear. <laughs> it won't be quiet for long. What's the job, Bob? Well, Scoop, we have to fit some safety lights inside the tunnel. OK, Bob. But first, you'd better set up the reflective barriers while Lofty and I put the lights up so we can see what we're doing. There. That's the cabling up for the safety lights. Oh, hello, Pilchard. Looks like you're having fun. We'd better get on, Scoop. Stay close, Pilchard. We don't want to lose you. Oh, dear. <laughs> What, what was that? Did you hear that, Travis? Uh, uh, Travis! Oh, pur purple potatoes. <laughs> there! That's the last one. Now to check everything works. <coughs> Don't touch that, Pilchard. <coughs> Remember, you should never play with electricity. <coughs> Good. Everything seems safe. Right. <laughs> that was a lesser spotted barn owl. <laughs> Come back, Pilchard. Oh, no. Pilchard's gone to find the owl. I'd better go after her. <laughs> It's just the wind. Yes, that, 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 that's what it is. I'll, um, I'll sing myself a song, then I won't hear the noises. <laughs> not scared. <laughs> Definitely not scared. <laughs> oh, no. It, it's, a, it's a horrible monster. I'm going back to the yard. Ah! Come back, Mark. I haven't finished scaring you. Come on, Travis. Faster! Faster! I, I... I can't go any faster. The trailer's very heavy. I know, Travis. I'll unhook the trailer so you can have a rest. <laughs> no! Spud! Don't! There you are, Travis. You'll soon... <laughs> oh! oh, dear. Oh, no! Oh, no! Hold on, Spud! <laughs>
everyone. Hey, Bob! Look at our new signpost. It's very nice, Dizzy. Hi, Bob. All right, Dizzy. You and Lofty can go now. I'll get a lift back to the yard with Muck. Oh, uh, um, yeah, OK, Wendy, bye. And see you later, Bob. Bye! I've got a present for you, Wendy. Oh, really, Bob? Apple pies from Mrs Broadbent. They're a bit overcooked, though. Oh, oh, dear. What was that? It sounded like Spud. Oh, no! Oh, look out! It is Spud, in Travis's trailer. Get out of the way! And he's heading for the signpost. Quick, Wendy, you take this pie. Oh, I see. Ready, Wendy? One, two, three. Oh, God, my cruel world. Ah! Oh. 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 Hooray! Hooray! Are you all right, Spud? <laughs> yes, I'm, I'm fine. I, I, I wasn't scared at all. Oh. What happened? Spud was trying to help Travis. He was feeling tired, so I unhooked his trailer. What's wrong with that? Well, I just got to the top of a hill. Oh. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, well, no harm done, eh? Come on, everyone. Let's go home for lunch. Oh, did you say lunch? I'm starving. Has anyone got anything to eat? Ha-ha! <laughs> How about this? It'll be lovely with a bit of custard. Oh. Hello, Scoop. What? Oh. oh, it's you. Yes. What are you doing? I'm guarding some very important bones. I found them, you know. Oh, let's have a look. Go on. Sorry, Spud. These are dinosaur bones and I'm not allowed to let anyone see them. Not even a little peep? No. Oh. I'll... Uh... I'll let you see the bones I found if you let me have a look at yours. Where? In that field over there. They're much bigger than your bones. Really? Yes, and I'm not allowed to let anyone see mine either. Well, Mr Ellis won't mind if I just take a quick look. <laughs> now then, let's... Cool. Spud, were you making up stories? I couldn't find any bones. Spud! Where'd he go? Ah, Scoop, I've come to collect the bones. Right you are, Mr Ellis. Wonderful. Quite wonderful. Oh, dear. And I was sure we had a complete skeleton. Oh, well. I'll just have to make the missing bones out of plaster. Oh, never mind, Mr Ellis. <laughs> <laughs> It'll still look brilliant. Yes, but a complete stegosaurus would have made our little museum famous all over the world. Maybe there are still some bones left in the field. I'll go back and have a look. Poor Mr Ellis. He was so disappointed. Bob, you don't think the missing bones might be the one Spud found? Spud? Yes, he told me he'd found some even bigger bones in the next field. But when I went to look, I couldn't find them anywhere. Um, Scoop, you didn't leave our bones unguarded, did you? Only for a minute, Bob. It was when... When... Oh, no. Spud! Spud? Spud. Parola, parola, pa. Come and see the fiercest, most scary, fierce dinosaur ever. What's that, Spud? This is a Spudulosaurus. Looks like a lot of old bones to me. Where'd you find them? He found them under a tarpaulin. Didn't you, Spud? I... Uh, I might have done. Well, they're not yours, Spud. They belong to the museum, and we're going to have to take them back. Oh, oh sorry, Bob. I, I was only looking after them for a bit, honest. <laughs> I'm ready for some more tiles, Lofty. Uh, OK, Bob. Here we are, Bob. Be careful, Spud. Those tiles are easily broken. Sorry, Bob. Let Lofty do it, OK? I was only trying to help, Bob. Well, Spud, I've got another job for you. 
Why don't you go back to the yard and check that Scoop's all right? You bet. Spud's on the job, Bob. Bob can rely on me. Don't worry, Scoop. Dr Spud will soon make you better. Woo! Brilliant! Oh, Wendy, it's just the job. Here, just a little something to say thank you. Well, that's very kind of you, Mrs Potts. <laughs> my pleasure. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's Spud, the spinning scarecrow. Why didn't you try her? <laughs> Get down, Spud. I was just checking it works. It isn't a toy, Spud. Anyway... Shouldn't you be scaring birds? Not today. Bob's given me an important job to do. Can't stand around talking. <laughs> oh, that scarecrow. Thanks, Mock. Well, I think we're all finished here. Hey, what's that, Lofty? Spud must have left it. we better take it back to the yard. Home we go. Spud calling Scoop. Oi! Don't wake him up, Spud. Scoop's not well. I know. Bob sent me to look after him. I've got to find out what makes Scoop sneeze. He's got hay fever, Spud. We know that already. But what if he's allergic to something else? Like, uh, like milk? Does this make you feel like sneezing? Spud! Leave Scoop alone! Um, what about... Cat fur? He is allergic to hay. Hay? Well, what about me? Scarecrows are stuffed with hay. Oh, what are you doing, Spud? Does this make you feel like sneezing? Don't be silly, Spud. You're made of old hay. Only fresh hay can make Scoop sneeze. I, are you all right, Scoop? <laughs> not, not too bad, thanks, Wendy. <laughs> uh, these flowers are fresh. Do they make you sneeze, Scoop? Spud! <laughs> <laughs> That's done the trick. Scoop! Spud? What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what's this? Oh, wow, a pirate treasure chest. Ha, 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 ha. Long John Spud's found treasure. <coughs> what's that, Scruffy? Do you want to be a pirate too? <coughs> Sorry, shipmate Scruffy. It's finders keepers. <coughs> <coughs> Shush, Scruffy, or I'll make you walk the plank. <laughs> Give us a lift, Travis. All right then, Spud. Hop in. Oh no, it's full of old rubbish. Where's the treasure, eh? Wendy, where's the time capsule? Well, it was... It, oh, it was right here. <coughs> where's it gone? Oh, I don't know, Bob. Oh, we better go and tell Mr Ellis. <coughs> oh, no. It's a disaster. It can't have gone far. Scruffy, how did you get off your lead? What are you doing with my welly? That's the welly I put in the time capsule. Scruffy, do you know where the time capsule is? I think he wants us to follow him. All right, Scruffy, find the time capsule. <laughs> Time to bury you, my little treasure chest. No, Scruffy, get off. <sighs> 
Spud, what have you got there? Uh, my treasure chest, Farmer Pickles. Oh, Spud, that's not a treasure chest. It's Mr Ellis's time capsule. But I found it. It was just <laughs> full of rubbish. That rubbish was all the special things people had donated, Spud. You can't just help yourself to things that don't belong to you. I'm sorry, Farmer Pickles. Sorry, Mr Ellis. And you're very lucky that Scruffy the detective found you before you buried it. Thanks, Scruffy. <laughs> Come on, Lofty. We've got a pipe to lay. Oh, um, OK, Bob. I'm glad that Scarecrow's not around. <laughs> OK, Lofty. Up you go. Oh, 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 easy, oh, easy, oh, oh, easy. Oh, 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 oh. oh, you nearly gave me a big fright. <laughs> oh, what a laugh. Oh, I'm glad you enjoyed it. You almost caused an accident. Oh, sorry, Bob. I was only playing. I didn't mean no harm, like. Well... Say sorry to Lofty, Spud. All right, then. Sorry, Lofty. Um, oh, it's nothing. I couldn't cope with it. Um, it's OK, Spud. It's about time you went and scared some birds off Farmer Pickle's lettuces. Yes, Bob. Sorry, Bob. Spud's on the job, Bob. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Now, we need to fill the line marking machine up with this special white paint. Right, as soon as roll is finished, we'll paint the white lines. Oh, this looks like fun. Lots of fun. <laughs> hello, Bob the Builder. Oh, hello, Mrs Potts. What can I do for you? Oh. Oh, dear. Well, I'll tell you what, I'll pop over quickly now. It won't take me five minutes to fix that. No, it's no problem. See you soon. Bye. Come on, Mock. We need to go over to Mrs Potts to do a quick repair job. Jump on, Bob. Back in a jiffy. All right, Bob, I'll be here. Can I? <laughs> oh, <laughs> joy. Hey, Travis! Travis! Oh, there you are! Uh, Farmer Pickles wants you down at the pond. He says it's very urgent. Oh, I'd better get going. See you, Rolly! Catch you later, Travis! <laughs> Oh, oh no! Travis! Travis! Stop! You're making lines everywhere! Oh, oh! I'm gonna have to try and catch him! <laughs> Hello? Where's Travis going in such an hurry? Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I'd better call Bob. Someone's got to stop Travis. Rolly! Rolly! <laughs> Follow that tractor! I'm trying! I'm trying! <laughs> oh, now for some fun. Oh. <laughs> what? I'm sure I put two bales here. <laughs> There's something funny going on here. Ha. Spud, 
I might have guessed. <laughs> I thought I'd help with the harvest, Farmer Pickles. Oh, thanks a bunch. But maybe you can do something really useful, like help me load the hay bales instead of unloading them. Um, uh, oh, uh, oh, I just remembered I saw a lot of birds in the lettuce fields. I'd better get back to work right away. Uh, you know, uh, get back to my proper job, uh, scaring birds like this. Boy, get out of it, bird! <laughs> <laughs> oh, ow! Oh. Oh. <laughs> So that's how you scare off the birds. <laughs> Spuds on the job. Now then. Oh. Yes, Tom, I'm sorry. I'd like one too. Maybe I could climb the apple tree. No, I'm hungry. There, there we go. Soon have the roof finished. Ah, I would have loved an apple, all juicy and sweet and... Oh, oh hang on. Bob's ladder, just what I need. <laughs> oh, yes, I'll have that, thank you. Right. Now for the next sheet. What? Where's my ladder? Oh, maybe it's fallen down. Dizzy! 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 Oh. Ah, of course. I'll phone Wendy, I'll get her to bring another ladder, and then... <gasps> oh. <laughs> This is the life. <laughs> what a feast. <laughs> I love apples. Hi, Spud. Um, shouldn't you be working? Uh, I'm having my lunch. <laughs> Get it puff, Travis. Me, uh, me. No. No, I'm not. No. Scoop's in front. Make your mind up, Bob. <laughs> Uh, oh. <laughs> oh! Oh, come on! Change, please! <sighs> Yahoo! Oh, no! <laughs> and now Travis is in the lead! It's amazing! I thought you said Scoop was winning. Oh, come on, Scoop. You can do it. That's right. Come on. Uh, oh. Come on, Scoop. You can do it. <laughs> wow, Bird. Scoop just flew past when... Uh, bird? <laughs> Whoa! Beep, beep. <laughs> Here they come. Quick, put me down, Lofty. That's it, Scoop. Not far now. Waha! Scoop, 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 scoop. <laughs> yes! Scoop, one scoop, one scoop, one scoop, one scoop, one. Stupid, 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 stupid. Travis, you lost. Uh, I can't believe it. Uh, what do you think you are playing at? Oh, my goodness gracious me. Spud? Uh, oh, sorry, Spud. I just got puffed out, I suppose. Puffed? Puffed? What do you mean, puffed? Oh. Spud, what have you been up to? What? At... Oh, um... I, I... Hey, that's all the stuff that kept slowing me down. Oh, Spud, that's not the kind of help I wanted. Um, um, I, I can explain. And uh, You see, it was, uh, well, it was like this. Um, uh, it was just a joke and, um... Spud, uh, my uh... <laughs>
pond. Oh, 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 oh dear, so we did try to warn you, but...